Hey guys, welcome to episode number two. Officially, it's episode number one, but we're going to go with... Actually, we're just going to go with episode number one. This is Dark and Light on the Voxel Squad server. I am your host, Renovate, and um, this is my third time recording this exact episode. When I started, I was level 11. I am now level 14. And the reason that I keep recording it is because the first time that I recorded was before the update. And I tamed a boar, recorded it, looked great. Um, and then after the update, for whatever reason, or during the night or something, uh, we had a rollback. And it was quite significant because half my base was uh, not there and I had my levels had went back a little bit. So now I'm recording... Uh, or in the second time I recorded, uh, we went, how come I can't open my door? Unlock it. There we go. Um, the second time I recorded it, we went out to get a, a boar again. And, um, I got kind of, um, what's the word? Um, well, anyways, I wanted a, more than one tame. So I made a stag harness and we tamed a boar and I found a stag and I went to tell the boar to not attack stuff that I was aiming at and immediately as soon as I clicked on it he ran towards the stag them two ran out panther killed the stag panther killed the boar panther killed me so fun times here in renovate land so uh, I think we're gonna try it again so we have everything that we need uh, we got the uh, boar saddle here. We got a ton of arrows to to tame him with, and the only thing we are missing is a trough, which we have down here. That's good. So we have our arrow, our bow. It's completely repaired, and I don't think there's anything else that we actually need. Is there anything that I could cast that will slow stuff down? Uh, frozen water. I was thinking there was a spell that we had that, that slows animals down. Retards enemy and reduces their weight limit. Hmm. Yeah, that's not it. Um, we're probably going to need to make some food. Because I don't have any food. But we could probably get some berries. So let's just journey out here for a little bit. And uh, I did notice that after the patch. Uh, I'm recording this. It's on a Saturday. I don't know what the... It's August the 5th, so I don't know when this is going to come out. Uh, but I think they've had like two patches uh, in the past week. And I did notice that the graphics, uh, uh, they do look a lot better. The problem that I was having is every time I'd change my graphics, they wouldn't... The, when I changed the sliders, even though you reset it, it didn't actually show up as being fixed. Um, I don't remember that being here. That's weird. Okay. So yeah, that's a thing. And um, I also noticed that there are white wolves around my house now. And they like to hang out right around this little area right here. But it's usually close to like nighttime is when I, when I see them the most. But yeah, we're just going to head down this little path. There's a big opening field out here that's got tons and tons of animals. And it's a really good, easy place to hide, or hide, a place to hunt. So that's where we're going to go. Hopefully we don't get killed. Hopefully we find a boar that's uh, somewhat low level. I think the last one, the first one I tamed was a 50, and I think it ended up being close to 70. And then the second one I got was a 60, and he only went up a couple percentage points. But the only reason I need them is because they're pretty fast to ride on. Um, I also have a saddle for a horse and a deer. and But I don't know. I haven't seen either one of those in this area. So I'm thinking maybe those are over in the in the human area. We're not going to go play with the humans yet. But we're going to go over here. So this is the plains area right up here over this hill. There's like a little uh, ruins area here, and then it kind of opens up. So this is a nice little place if you're getting 
chased by something to run here because there's lots of obstacles uh, that the animals can't seem to path through like this one you can go here then through here and then you know keep running around and the animals don't seem to understand that there's objects there and they just they like go like this they just sit there and try to get through the wall so it's pretty easy the other good place that I found was over here on top of this rock. Oh, there's a stag. Oh, he's pretty. I wonder what I hope he's not running from something. Maybe he's running to something. But anyways, if you stand on top of this rock and try to tame stuff, I thought I saw a tail. Um, the animals can't get up here at all. So they basically run around this perimeter trying to get you, uh, and they can't even they can't get up here. So it's a good place to, um, if you've ever played like any other RPG games, like World of Warcraft or something, or I forget what the other one's called, but uh, you kite them basically, you tag them and then make them chase you and then take them somewhere. So I'm not seeing any boars yet. So we're gonna go. Like, there's a boar way out there, but I'm not, I might go ahead and try to get that one. Usually the panthers are out in that area over there. So what time is it? It's five o'clock, so it's, the sun's just coming up. So let's go over here and see if we can get one of these bad guys. Hopefully we don't see a panther. There's two boars there. Uh, yeah, I'm not seeing any panthers. That's awesome. Maybe they're sleeping. Uh, the one thing about the boars, though, is they uh, tend to aggro if you get really close to them. So you just want to run up and see what, what level they are. So that one's a 28. And this dude is a 36. And I thought I saw another one somewhere. Is that the only two that we see? Yeah. See, there's a panther. I don't know if you can see it, but way out there. Here, I'll tilt my camera down. You see that thing in the water? I'm pretty sure it's a panther attacking something. A panther or a hyena. Neither one of them we want. So, I think we're going to tag this dude right here. I think this was the higher level one. Was it? Yeah, he's a 36. Okay. So, we got to get number five. Make sure that we have... Oops, make sure that we have the right arrows in here. We do. All right. So we are going to... Let's do this. Just make sure I know my surroundings before I start running, because I don't want to run towards something that's bad. All right, let's do this. Okay. And then you just keep tagging them, and then putting these things on the ground, and then run away... Run around circles, and then eventually they get worn out. And sometimes they'll hit you. And sometimes you get stuck in their body, which is freaking annoying. Oh, geez, what? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, the other dude came to help him. We can take on two. That's okay. This is boss. There we go. We got him. Yep, we got him. Let's try this. We'll just put this guy out too. Uh, make sure he doesn't die. Oh, wow. <laughs> they learned to go over rocks. All right. This was the lower level one. He's taking a lot more. Ah, she's more of that rock. Oh, he's running away. So he's getting ready to get tired. There. Yep. Okay. We want this one over here though. So where'd he go? He's right here. So we want to get our number six and we're going to put it right there. And we're going to go down here and get as many berries as we can, or apples. They really like the apples, I found, better than the berries. But it doesn't matter. So we're going to throw these in here. 
I don't know if they like that or not. So let's just go down here. Let's get some more of these. You know what? I think if we use our hands, we get more berries, maybe. No, it doesn't seem to. Get your sword out, man. man. Get your sword. Get your sword out. Oh, I broke it. Well, poop. Okay. Uh, let's see if we can get some apples. All right. Let's get you. How much is he taming? Yeah, he's taming pretty quickly. All right. So let's get uh, our axe out and see if we can get some apples out of this tree. There's an apple. They also haven't fixed the uh, quest line thing. That box just stays there. What are we? What do we got a lot of that we could get rid of? Uh, we can go ahead and drop. Well, actually, we need to repair. What do we need to repair this with, though? Here, let's put this up here. What do we need to repair? It? Uh, wood and stone. So I just need a couple more stone. Let's give this guy his his apples. Let's feed him those and some more berries. How much time you got left on you, man? Uh, uh, not that much longer. Okay, let's get some stones. Whoops. So yeah, guys, uh, it was a unanimous decision or unanimous vote to have me do this series. And so I thank you for voting. Uh, I think it was, it ended up being close to 30 votes, I think, which is cool. Um... I don't need this. I think the next thing we're going to tame is a sheep. How you doing, my man? How much food you got left? Um, You ate the apples, didn't you? All right. What's your constitution? Okay, that's good. All right, I want to make sure that nothing's coming. All right, so let's get some more. Let's see if we can get some more apples. If you guys know a better way of getting apples... Um, I found that the spruce trees um, have a better drop rate for apples. I don't need any of that drop item. Uh, like the big pine trees over there, which is kind of weird because pines don't have uh, apples. But yeah, so let's go in here. See, you can't harvest this with an axe. So you got to use your sword. Oh, I didn't put the sword in my inventory. It's been like a couple days since I've played, so you gotta excuse my 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 dumbness. Alright. There we go. I don't know why this improves your decorating skill, but it does. <laughs> I guess it's because you're getting uh some stuff for decorating. I don't know. Let's put that in here. Uh let's go ahead and drop all this grass. And how close are you, my man? You are taming pretty quickly. That's good. I just want to make sure that this other guy over here doesn't wake up. And what we could probably do is change our arrows out just in case he wakes up. But we could go check his his uh, thing and make sure that he's not going to wake up anytime soon. Yeah, he's got a while before he'll wake up. So we're going to leave him here. We're going to get this guy here. He's almost tamed. And he ate. So he doesn't like the grass at all. Actually, he just ate the grass. Huh. Interesting. Let's go over here and chop down some of these trees. I don't see any berries in that. It's just all grass. I found, I usually find all the berries down here in the water. A little delayed there. All right, so let's. Uh, do these give you any hunger and thirst? We need some because our thirst is way down. And he's actually eating the grass. That's kind of cool. All right, let's give him the rest of the berries. And he's about a couple minutes from being tamed. The water's not deep enough to get a drink.
All right, so I think what we're going to do now is we're going to put a saddle on him and then maybe come back and try to get a stag and take it to the base. I look at this stag over here. That guy is awesome looking. Black with blue stripes. Level... S oh. Uh, let's put our brackets. Let's put Rin. And then let's name him Boss. Boss Hog. All right. So this is what I was doing uh, the other day. I was trying to cycle him to uh, not attack anything that I was doing. Let's equip the saddle. But uh, that didn't seem to work. So what level did he end up being a 51? That's not that bad. What is that little mark? I don't know if you can see that, but it's right above where it says boss. There's like a little trough. Uh, if he press, I got my thing set up. If I press F, he'll come to me and G makes him stand still. So let's take this. Let's take all the stuff out of here. Let's just take all. And then let's uh, demolish this. Whoops. All right. So that was a lot quicker than it typically is for me because I've done it so many times. It's not really hard to do now. Um, but his weight is 270. That's not that bad. Let's ride him. Oops. Let's get back on him. Ride. Um, let's see here. Can we make anything while we're driving around? I don't know if we can make some more staves just for fun. I was thinking of uh, making a staff for each one of these. Um, that way I don't have to cycle through because I'm having a hard time. Like if I use one, I got to stop working and click on this one to switch it. So I might go ahead and do that. Let's just go ahead and craft four of those while we're... Why we're doing and these guys are pretty fast see and they they they're they do pretty good when you're hunting like if you're hunting sheep uh you know what we could probably go ahead and tame a sheep and have him come with us g um does it matter which i guess i'll just take this so he is set to docile I don't know what that means <laughs> change targeting range for medium to open auto ride hell's running permission blah blah, blah unclaim all right hopefully if I shoot this thing here he will not he will not uh, he will not try to kill it if he does then we know docile is not the right thing I can't remember what it is because it's been so long since I've done it in arc but we'll try this You're not getting away. Whoops, missed. I got him right in the butthole. <laughs> Whoops. All right, let's see if he can hear me. Yeah, he can. Good. All right, so... All right, the reason I want a sheep is because they produce fur. And let's see what it may, we need to make another trough. So we need, uh, we have no wood. We have everything except wood. So we just need to make, get some wood right here and then we can make a trough. And I'm not quite sure what they eat. I'm guessing it's grass. That'd be my best guess. Just from, you know, experience on the farm, which I've never been on. All right, let's do this. Um, where's it at? Why am I not seeing it? Oh, there it is. What am I missing? Oh, I need more wood. Jeez. I didn't know that much wood. All right, there we go. So here's our trough. Craft that. And... Bump. Okay, it's number six. Put this next to you. And then let's fill that with, I'm guessing, grass or straw. Uh, he doesn't want the straw. Okay, that's fine. What about berries? Grass and berries. Twigs and berries. All right, so he is taming super fast. And we're going to get us a farm of fur. So we get two, two tames. I don't think they have a sheep saddle. That'd be kind of awkward. <laughs> okay. Uh, I don't think we're even going to name them. 
Might name this one Bo and get another name Peep. Well, Bo Peep lost a sheep. Uh, this constitution's going down really fast. All right, I think we're going to be okay. How much is he eating? Yeah, he's eating. All right, that's fine. Come on. It's like it's stuck. Maybe not. I don't know. Oh, there it goes. I was going to say, if you put another arrow in it, their constitution goes way back up. And that's basically their, I think their Torpor, I forget what, what that rating is, but it's, um, it's like your tranquilizer power, I believe. And we are super, super thirsty. So let's see if I have, I keep pressing escape because I've been playing another game. I don't think, there we go. Let's name him Rin. And we'll name him Bo. Let's just name him Bo Peep. All right. So we got him. We're going to cycle him on follow. All right. And we're going to get on this guy, and he should. Come on. Well, he's not the quickest of them all. All right, so we finally made it back to our house. Uh, I think it's his targeting range because if I slow down and he stays at like a medium range, so I think it's a targeting range that helps that. So let's jump off it. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, jump off here. Um, tell him to stay. And then let's whistle to this guy. Come on, man. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> uh, let's change it from... Uh, change starting range from low range. Here we go. There we go. It's like a little puppy. Come on. In here. There we go. All right. Stay. All right. I think we need to make a feeding trough again. So let's see if we got enough wood to do that. Uh, probably not. So let's do this. We need some more wood and some more twine. So uh, you stay here. I'll be right back. We'll go over here to this tree. Get us some twine and some wood. I always get, uh, if you, I don't know if you can see my FPS on this, but I always get, my FPS drops so bad when I'm in this one spot right here. I mean, it's amazing. I don't know what it is. I need to go get some water. I'm about ready to be parched. Do I have enough to make it now? Um, it doesn't look like it. So I'm missing... I got twine. I'm missing wood. So I just need to chop down another tree. I'll go get some water here in a second. It's not that important. All right, that's all I needed. If I press eight, this lightens me up a little bit. Well, it used to. <laughs> so yeah, the the sheep make fur, and I think all you got to do is feed them grass. I don't remember. I don't remember if you got to feed them in the trough or you just feed them. So we're gonna go over here and see, and we're gonna make our. I know my health is getting low. I'm aware of that. Do these give you, um, no, can I eat grass? No, not really. All right, so I got an apple. Let's put the number six right here. Let's put it right beside him. And I'm pretty sure it's grass. It might be wheat. Nope, it's just grass. And then I think that if you click on him and search him, what does it say? Furs from animals. Um, is it this? It requires grass. Okay, that's what it was. So let's take the grass out of here. Let's take uh, this 
and then put it. Oh, I didn't mean to drop it, and I didn't mean to do a barrel roll. All right, and put that in him like a so, and then click on that, and then he'll craft us up some fur. And it doesn't. It's not like the quickest thing in the world. So let's keep that like that. Let's search that. Um, let's put let's put that in there, and that, and that, and all these stabs for right now. And let's go in here. Nope, but I want to demolish. I want to search this. So let's go in here and put wrong one. This heck on. Why does it keep doing that? Um, there we go. Let's put that and that and that. All right. So I'm gonna run down to the river and get some water, and then uh, I'll see what else we can get our. Or if I can get on this dude, I'll see what else we can get into. Be right back. All right, guys. So the uh, thing I was trying was to make all those stabs and then to click on each one so that they would have their own spell, but it doesn't seem to work. So if I click on number one and I change it to spell number six, and then click on number two and change it to spell number six, it doesn't work. <laughs> so, yeah, that's not a thing. So that was a waste of time, but at least we know. Um, so yeah, I am making some food right now. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Uh, I made some of this yummy stuff. I think I got some berries in here. Do I got any berries left? Yes, I do. I made some of this stuff, which is good. And then if I take this and I put the berries in here, we can make this. And that, that meat's much better than what we had. And then we'll go over here, and this is where I've been putting all our, well, I did. Um, that's all that. We got a bunch of glass. I made a bunch of glasses just to see what was happening. And then, uh, it looks like we're hungry, so we'll go ahead and eat. Um, I don't really have that much left to do in this episode, guys. Um, let's go ahead and, and use. And let's use a couple of those. Yeah, it's making our hunger go up. I just want to get ourselves, at least get some food in our bellies. Use that. Oh, wow, it's actually raining. How about that? Oh, I see it raining. Yeah, it's raining. It's actually raining inside our hut. That's excellent. So we're getting really close to level 15. I think that's all I'm going to do for this episode. I don't know. Is it F7? No. Um... What one turned your... Is there a way to take a screenshot on here? Let's go in here and look. Options. Um, game. Key bindings. Anything say screenshot? Um, toggle fist. Selfie cam. We'll make that... Uh, can we make that one J? I don't think that's a, applied to anything. Let's save that. Let's press J. Oh, that's weird. Can we go like this? Okay, cool. So there's our two teams, guys. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, make sure you hit that like button. Also, if you're new to my channel, hit make, make sure you hit that subscribe button and check out everybody else that's recording on the Voxel Squad. Uh, the link to the, the, the Discord is down at the bottom, as well as the Twitter. So I'll see you next time, guys. It's been episode number one, Dark and Light. It's been fun. Woo! Oh, I screwed that up. Okay, there we go. I need to learn my emotes. Bye-bye.